to safety concerns on mass transit in two major cities. Eight high school students were shot getting on a bus in Philadelphia, and New York City is responding to a spike in crime on the subway system. Senior investigative correspondent Aaron Katursky has more. Good morning, Aaron. Michael, good morning to you. After a rash of violence in and around mass transit, passengers are on edge. So the National Guard's deploying into the subway here in New York and in Philadelphia. They're trying to fend off safety fears at the bus stop. This morning, police in Philadelphia are looking for whoever stepped out of this car and opened fire on a group of high school students boarding a public bus. It's going to be Gottman and Rising Sun, sir. I got multiple people shot. Three individuals exited that vehicle and then the charges multiple times, at least over 30 times they fire into the kids that are getting onto the bus. Overnight, police releasing this video to the public seeking any information. It was the fourth shooting this week near a public bus in Philadelphia. We will not be held hostage, that we will use every legal tool in the toolbox to ensure the public health and safety of the people of our city. In New York, that means deploying the National Guard into the subway to help police conduct bag checks after a series of violent attacks. And riding the subway, which should just simply be part of your everyday life, is filled with stress and trepidation. Less than two hours after the governor's announcement, a subway conductor was hit by a glass bottle. A week ago, a different conductor had his throat slashed. I think it's worse than ever. It's been getting worse for the last couple of years. And since the ridership seems to still be down from COVID, you feel a little alone down there. A spike in crime in the subways at the start of the year has subsided, but George, the governor says heinous attacks cannot be tolerated. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.